Daryl, good 2 0 win. Just tell us how important it was to get that three points today. Um, yeah, very important. Every game's important. Every, every point, all, all points are important. Um, it was a good performance. Great to get another clean sheet. That's, we can see the one goal in five games now, which seems terrific. Um, and like I said, happy to get the win. And the two goals from Mitch Bundle and Angelo Galanta, how pleasing was it for you to see both of them on the score sheet? Yeah, delighted. Delighted. I think um, Ange showed his quality at times today. We know, we know he's still not up to, up to match speed yet. Delighted for Mitch. I think Mitch does a lot of unseen running and he, he spends a lot of energy playing for us in midfield. And I was delighted to get a touch of what I say with the goal. And, you know, as, as I said, clean sheets. I love a clean sheet and, and it's always brilliant for us. And it was a set piece goal that Brundle put away at the far post. Was that something that you've worked on, like a routine one, or was it just him being in the right place at the right time? No, we work on set pieces, obviously, like our team, so I won't give too many secrets away. Um, ben Hals did very well to win the ball back in the build up to that Balanta goal before squaring it to him. Um, is that obviously something that you look for in a striker as well as just putting the goals away? No, we, we felt today that, not knowing a lot about um, Jimmy in the sense of he, he's obviously been at West Brom and not been at this level, so to watch how he teams play has been difficult, so we managed to get hold of a couple of games at Kidderminster, and we've seen the shape they played and the style of play they played. So something that we looked at that we topically pressed, pressed them high, we left the force ball out, and I thought Ben House on that next minute today. And Elliot Justin has ever pulled off a couple of top saves to keep that clean sheet that you mentioned today, just how good was he out there? Yeah, he's always good. I think he's made too many saves today for us, really. I think. Um, but as good as we were, I think there was times when we, we a lapse of concentration and it was almost cost us. Um, so yeah, no, he was good, as, as he always is, but um, too many saves in my life. And a larger than normal crowd here for Daggett Celebrate Diversity Day, how good is it for the team to have that little bit of extra volume while they're out there? Yeah, it's great to win in front of a, 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 a packed, packed house here today. We said when I'm at this place of Fortress, uh, like I said, we've been pretty good here so far since I come in. We want to build on it. And we saw you take Angelo Blanter off for Chica Candy. Was that just like I said, because he's not quite up to match speed yet? No fresh injury concerns for anyone? No, no, everyone's fine. No, we just with Angelo just protected him really. I think we can't um, we can't flog him yet. I think he's got to you know build build his way back into up to his fitness. And quite a quick turnaround now um, before ahead of the Barnet game. Um, did you just get the guys back in on Monday and get them straight onto that and have a look at their sort of footage and just get them straight back into gear? Yeah, straight back in. This game's over now until the next one.